On today's 3 Minute Thursday, we are taking a look at a new plugin for Cura 3.5. Hey, welcome to The First Layer. My name's Richard Cleveland. I'm your host here exploring the world of 3D printing. And on today's 3 Minute Thursday, we're diving into a new plugin for Cura 3.5. So we're gonna dive right in right away. We're gonna put three minutes on the clock. All right, so we are gonna go up to our toolbox and you'll see here where it says Browse Packages. We're gonna click on that. It's gonna open up this window. And the package today that we are concerned with is the Cura Settings Guide. Now, this is a very exciting uh, new guide because what it does is that it will help you through some of the features that you may not understand in Cura by giving you not only uh, deeper explanations, but also maybe some visual guides too. Let's go ahead and install it. We will click on it and then we'll hit install. It only takes a couple of seconds. Now, you will need to restart Cura before changes in the package take effect. So we're gonna go ahead and quit Cura and we're gonna open it back up again. Okay, so now it's been reloaded. We're back into Cura. Let's take a look and see if it's done anything different for us here. Well, we still get the traditional information that we got for layer heights and, and all of the other uh, little doodads that are in here. But let's close up quality and I'm gonna show you where you're gonna find this. You go up to extensions, down, you can see it here down at the bottom, just underneath update checker and you go settings guide. It will open up this window. I'm gonna move it over just a little bit for you. And you can see as version 1.0.0, let's click on quality for a moment. Well, there's still no information there. When we click on the actual item, we can see here that it gives a plethora of information. This is really handy for learning about Cura 3.5. This is amazing. No other program that I've seen to date has any of this. Look at that, layer heights, you can get in and you can actually click on those so you can bring them up a little bit bigger on your screen. You click them again, they go away. So this is gonna give you a lot more detailed information than what you're going to find in just hovering over like we did, say an infill. And there you go. So that is how to utilize this extension for Ultimate Cura. This is the settings guide, and I hope you guys learned something. Go and install this extension today and that takes care of our three minutes. I think we even got time to spare. Man, that is a really cool feature in Cura 3.5. It's really making me like this software a whole lot more than I did in the past. I found it in the past to be a little bit clunky, and that's why I use Simplify 3D. But the more I explore this for you guys, the more I'm really starting to like some of the new features in Cura 3.5. Let's thank a few people starting off with our good friends over at Spool 3D. Without them, of course, we wouldn't have this. So thank you to Spool3D.ca. They've got everything that you need from printers to filaments and all of the accessories and parts that you may need for your next upgrade or build project. Check them out today at Spool3D.ca. Print it right. Print it with Spool 3D. I want to thank my amazing staff, Brian Baker, who's behind the controls today on this 3-Minute Thursday. We want to thank Jess Corniching, the lovely Jess. And of course, Frank, always awesome, awesome. There you go. See, I got that right, I think. And of course, wouldn't be complete without my lovely wife, Geraldine. Now, I also want to thank my Patreons for sticking with us on this. So remember, if you want to become a Patreon, you can go to patreon.com slash the first layer. Sign up for one of our levels over there. But if you're not into a monthly commitment, hey, go ahead. Check out our Buy Me a Coffee at buymeacoffee.com slash the first layer because we all like coffee around here and all that money kind of goes into the same pot anyway to help us do upgrades for you guys and get stuff that we need that we wouldn't normally have. Now, 
where am I going from here? I have no idea because it's three minute Thursday and I rushed through this so fast. No, I'm not out of here just yet. I do want to let you guys know that uh, I want to thank you for, for coming by and, and watching 3 Minute Thursday today. I also want to let you remind you that if you are new here, please hit that subscribe button, that little bell notification so you get notified every time we do a brand new episode. Like, subscribe, and share. And we will see you next time on the first layer. Remember that the first layer is always your foundation to a great print.